On September 24th, I received a $3.96 donation from Andrew Hagen Svensson. Godspeed, Jarrah. You are now one millionth of the way. That same day, I also received another $75 from Carl Goss. He sent me this email with the donation. Dear Jarrah, I have made a modest donation of $75. I also wish to make a small request. Unlike you, I believe the Apollo missions really happened. My IQ is quite modest, and there is something strangely comforting about believing that authorities don't lie. I believed Father Christmas was a real person until I hit my mid-twenties, and I recently managed to get an extra swine flu jab by impersonating a neighbour that migrated abroad two years ago to make sure I was fully immunised. Anyway, I think it is a real shame that few, if any, pictures were taken from the moon's surface of the planet Earth. I haven't seen one. Did they take any? As I suspect, the most eye-catching and memorable feature when walking on the moon would be the sight of our own planet hanging imposingly overhead. The moon viewed from Earth is quite eye-catching and not that small, so appearing nearly four times larger, I guess the Earth viewed from the moon's surface should be absolutely awesome. So could you remember to take plenty of Earth's photos when you finally get to do your moonwalk and publish them on YouTube so we can all see this wonderful sight? You will probably remember to record this amazing sight photographically without me having to request it, but as NASA made little of it, I thought it prudent to prompt you and make sure it is not overlooked again. A picture of the Earth taken from behind the LEM so you get a feel of the scale of this all-watching Earth in the sky would be a magical shot, I am sure. Many people appear to be in support of your proposed moon expedition, but talk is cheap, so I hope that many more people start to donate so that you can safely pencil in a launch date and enter the flight training stage. Believers and non-believers alike will benefit from your personal inspection of the Apollo sites, Whatever happens, it will make a very interesting YouTube documentary. So I hope the fund starts to receive the donations it truly deserves. I don't always agree with your conclusions. I think it is mainly because I failed science at school. But your videos are great, and I wish you the best of luck. In anticipation of viewing your future Earth shots complete with limb in foreground, thank you for reading this email. Yours faithfully, Carl Goss. Well, I should clarify that my upcoming mission is only a lunar flyby, not a lunar landing. But I'll be sure to take pictures of the Earth, if I survive the radiation that is, which I must emphasize is doubtful. The total amount of funds raised is $275 US. Only 199,999,725 dollars to go.